Jackson County commissioners voted for a resolution against same-sex marriage tonight. The vote, vote makes uh, Dixon the sixth Tennessee County to approve a proposal that goes against the Supreme Court's ruling that made same-sex marriage legal. Tonight's meeting was so highly anticipated, the room filled up three hours before the meeting started. Our Rebecca Schleicher was in Dixon County for this vote where tensions were running high. It's a fight that's been heating up across Tennessee counties ever since the Supreme Court ruling over the summer. And tonight here in Dixon County, commissioners took a unanimous stance against same-sex marriage. A spirited crowd took to the steps of the Dixon County Courthouse. The fact that you sit there and try to force your religion upon somebody who does not believe in your religion is uh, that's I'm awful. not trying to force it, I'm just that's speaking exactly my mind. Many of them neighbors, but separated into two colors this night. Those in red supporting same-sex couples. We have no idea why a county government would want to pass a resolution against part of its own population. Those in blue against the Supreme Court ruling that made them legal. I think that the Supreme Court decision overrode the will of the people of the state of Tennessee. Tuesday night. The resolution is just to send a message to the state to say, you know, this, this is how we feel about this issue and we want you to take action. It was a unanimous vote. All in favor vote by stating aye. 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 County commissioners passed a resolution asking the state and federal government to take a stand against same-sex marriage. It happened fast in the crowd of more than 200. We feel called to serve a God and do what he commands us to do. We moved outside where discussion got heated. Bigots. Christian people love gay people. We just simply have a standard of what's yeah, we right. Do, we well, do. if you love people, you don't want to take their health insurance away from them. You don't want to mess up their parenting arrangements. You don't want to disrupt their hospital visitation. The sheriff himself broke up the group. I'm, I'm entitled to protest. You're, you're right. You're right. You're right. But you're right. But keep it peaceful. We, it's not we worth it. Open up it's the not worth it. But with at least four more counties taking up the issue. The fight is far from over. And tomorrow in the state legislature, a similar issue will be discussed in a House committee meeting. This is an issue that's being discussed on multiple levels of government here in Tennessee. In Dixon County, Rebecca Schleicher, News Channel 5. Now, in the last half hour, Carter County also approved similar uh, res uh, resolution. Morgan, McMinn, Johnson, Green, and Sullivan County approved resolutions against same-sex marriage before tonight. And last week, Rutherford County took up this issue but changed the wording to exclude any mention of marriage before then passing it. And Rebecca just mentioned a similar bill on same-sex marriage is scheduled to be heard in a House subcommittee tomorrow. State Representative Mark Pody from Lebanon introduced the measure called the Tennessee Natural Marriage Defense Act. It aims to uphold the state constitution at the expense of the Supreme Court's gay marriage ruling. At a rally today, Pody urged supporters to contact the five members of the panel to persuade them not to kill the bill. Meanwhile, on tonight's open line, civil rights attorney Abby Rubenfeld, Abby Rubenfeld said the measure is, quote, blatantly unconstitutional. The Constitution of the United States is supreme. It governs what we do in this country. We fought a civil war in the 1800s about this very issue, whether states could nullify federal actions, and they can't. And the bill is scheduled to be heard at 3 o'clock tomorrow.